Hey everybody and welcome to this tutorial on how to push your Visual Studio Code project to GitHub. Now whether you're a seasoned developer or just starting out, mastering this process is essential for collaborating with others and managing your code effectively. Now as part of this tutorial, it is assumed that you have already installed Visual Studio Code and Git on your machine and you already have a GitHub account created. So first things first, open up your Visual Studio Code editor and make sure you have your project ready to go. Here I have an HTML file and a CSS file and a readme file that I've been working on. Now I'd like to commit this to a GitHub repository so it's accessible to others that can work on it with me. Now first things first, I want to navigate to the source control view with inside Visual Studio Code. Now I can do this by clicking on the icon on the left hand side or by pressing Control Shift and G on a Windows machine. When you open the source control view, you will be first asked if you want to initialize the repository. Click on this button. This creates a new Git repository in the current folder, allowing you to start tracking code changes. Now this is the equivalent to actually running the command git init from a command line, but we're doing it inside the graphical user interface. Now, once you've initialized the repository, the source control view will change and it will show you the changes you've made inside that file and folder and project. And now it's time to commit our changes. So we're going to write a small message inside the commit box and then we're going to hit commit. And that's us. We've hit our first commit for our code and started to track them locally. But what we want to do is push those changes to GitHub. So in order to do that, we need to head to GitHub and create a new repository. So head on over to your browser and go to GitHub's website. Now, depending on where you are inside GitHub, you should see a create new button in the right hand corner. Make sure you select new repository. We're going to walk through creating the repository, making sure we avoid to initialize the repository because we're going to push our code into it. But once we've filled in all of the wizard, we can click create new. Now, once the repository has created, we'll see the quick setup section. And what we want to do is copy the URL that's displayed there. Once we've copied that, let's switch back over to the Visual Studio Code editor. Now, still within our source control view, let's click on the ellipsis. Select Pull Push from the drop down menu and then select Push To. A pop up will display saying the repository has no remotes to push to. Click on the Add Remote button. Now enter the URL you copied from GitHub. And then type in the name of the repository that you created a minute ago and hit Return. Visual Studio Code now sets up that our GitHub repository and our local repository are linked and we can push and pull code between the two. We now have a button that says Publish Branch. Let's click on that so as we can push our code to GitHub. Within a few seconds, your, your code has now been pushed to GitHub. And if we head on over to our browser and refresh the page, we can see that our code is now there. And just like that, your changes are now on GitHub for the world to see. We can make additional changes to our code either inside GitHub or locally and push and pull and sync between the two. Now that's a wrap folks. You've successfully pushed your Visual Studio Code project to GitHub. Now remember, mastering this process is crucial for collaborating with others and managing your code effectively. Happy coding folks.